my mom got my dad for Christmas. It says Adam and Crystal, 628 2002 when they got married. And then it has a song from West Side Story. It's their, their wedding song. So sweet. That's my example of true love. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the final day of Vlogmas, Vlogmas day 25. Welcome to the chat, mom. Charge them up. Put them on the airplane. <laughs> Anyway, obviously I've missed the last few days. We will talk about that a little bit later, but I, as you can see, just got ready. I need to put, finish my lips up. But it is Christmas morning, so Merry Christmas to all who celebrate. If you do not, I hope you have a fantastic end of December. I am wearing my mom's Jordan hoodie. We are going to see the color purple. Me, my mom, my mom's friend Melody, and Melody's sister. Harmony. Twin. Twin sister. So that's what we're doing. Um, I'm wearing my mom's Jordan crew neck. I'm wearing these leggings from Amazon and I'm probably just gonna wear docks because I feel like my Nikes don't really go with what we're doing here. I mean, the docks don't either, but we can only do so much. Yeah, we're gonna go see the color purple. So excited. If you've never seen the original, go watch it. If you know what I'm talking about, then you already know the tea. So it's gonna be really fun for me to go with my mom and just have our little black girl moment, which is so exciting. You should definitely see the movie if you're not black, especially if you're not black, educate yourself. The movie musical just came out, so that's what we're gonna go do. We opened our Christmas gifts. I will do a what I got for Christmas in this vlog as well later. I did end up getting her this mascara. This is my favorite mascara, and I only have the mini version, but I bought her the big one because I have big love for her. We've just made it to the theater. This is everybody. This is my mom. You've seen her before. This is Melody. You might have seen her on Instagram. We went to Disneyland once. This is our twin sister. You've never seen her. This is Harmony. Hello. 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 <laughs> we're color purpling today. Yes, we're, we're all in our purple. We're also simply yeah. going to be late. Let's um, do it. Movie starts in 10 minutes, so we got to go. So I'll see you in there, but I got to be chill because I don't want to get in trouble. Okay. <laughs> Sob, sob, sobbing, sob, sob. Go see it. Go watch it. I'm a mess. Ah, uh, I'm a mess. <laughs> Black girls win. Uh. All right. Okay. Consensus, everybody. We just watched the color purple. I simply did sob my eyes out. Um, how's everybody feeling? Temperature check. Um, I'm a little depressed. <laughs> It was 10 out of 10. Yeah, it was more, even more than yeah, that. Yeah. Like the best. Everyone did such an amazing job. Yes. Fantasia, my God. Like, I mean, so good. just. So and Taraji, good. come on. I, she killed that one. I, I was like, not know. I didn't know she could sing. I didn't know she had it in there. She but she did, she did that. great. She yes. did. And Danielle Brooks. Uh, um, and um, Sierra. Hello. Yes. 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 So I, I simply did not. I was like, not Sierra, not one two step. <laughs> right. and, and, and everybody the one two step. And the whoopee cameo, yeah, that was oh, great. That was awesome. That was amazing. Yeah, she was great. It's, it's a lot. must see. Yeah, it's a must see. It's a must see. It's um for everybody, games. literally everybody go see it, but for the black girls. You wear need purple. to see it. Wear yeah. purple and go wear see it. Purple. Take your mom, take your sister, like take your friends. It's simply it's it's 10 out of 10. It's an 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. All right, sure. well, um, see y'all at home. We got a soundtrack to listen to. And fans. we got to go. Bye, Ryan. <laughs> What'd she say? She said, Bye, Ryan's fans. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and that's our cue. Oh, now she may not be here. Okay, so it's much later. I'm in my garage. I'm never in here, but there are so many people here, like spending the night at my parents' house that I, like, this is the only room that there's not another person in and you might be able to hear me. You're gonna hear some garage sounds, but it's that versus people. And I feel like garage sounds might be a little bit better. So pardon the background. I originally had planned to do a, like what I got for Christmas. I did that last year and like a bunch of other creators do it as well. But I just, there are a few things. I just feel like I don't really want to be like, look at all the things I got. Not that I'm not grateful, not that I'm not so lucky to have those things, but like, I just feel like it's not necessary. It's not really adding to any conversation. 
it's not really helpful it's just unnecessary so i just i just don't want to do that um i just feel like i just want to talk more about how grateful i am that i'm with my family and that i'm able to be with my family um and that we're all healthy and here together um because so many people all over the world congo sudan palestine all of those places that aren't with their families and I'm just very lucky that I get to be with mine and yes we had a great Christmas and I got great gifts and I'm so grateful for that but I just feel like I don't really I just don't feel like I want to do that so I'm gonna ramble on about that however in future vlogs when I am using a product that I got for Christmas or like am wearing something that I got I will be like oh yeah my mom got me this for Christmas it's XYZ so I'm not gonna not ever talk about what I got for Christmas I'm just not about to do a haul right now so hope you guys understand um, but yeah, so I also wanted to just talk about sorry. I'm so distracted There's so much in this garage to look at There's just things all over this place, and I'm just very distracted. So if you see me just like wandering It is like a museum in here <laughs> So basically I posted on Instagram and YouTube here in the community tab like hey guys I'm not gonna be completing vlogmas in the full 25 videos I am incredibly burnt out all of my footage from the holiday party got deleted and I was already like really struggling to like catch up with myself um, and and the footage getting deleted was just <laughs> my breaking point I was like you know what I'm just gonna take this day off it's fine like it's okay so I took that day off filmed the next day kind of I kind of filmed it was a very like I had I was with my group of friends I was with a group of friends that I hadn't been in an entire group with and like years and years and years and these were like my closest friends growing up in theater so i was just really present and then earlier that day my whole family was just downtown spending time together and i was just like really present for that and visiting with that so i didn't really film a lot and i've talked about it before like i was just i could feel the overwhelm like creeping up and it was just there and i was like i'm just gonna stop for a second catch my breath because sure i could just force myself to post a video and work on something and do something but if i am literally fighting it and resisting it i they i just need to take a moment and so i was just gonna stop like i was just gonna be like you know what i did 21 videos obviously i would have rather had done the 25 but like i did 21 videos back to back filming editing and posting every single day starting december 1st i did what i set out to do i wanted to see if i could film edit and post every single day that's what i was trying to do for myself obviously my goal was 25 videos of course but I wanted to know, am I capable of filming, editing, and posting every single day while also simultaneously doing my actual real nine to five job while also simultaneously like doing the podcast and also living my life and having relationships and like feeding myself? And the answer is yes. The answer is yes. Is it hard? 100%. But now that I know I can do it, filming, editing, and posting every single day is extreme in my case i don't want to be a daily vlogger so what is the balance between one video a week versus one video every day like i want to find my sweet spot within those two things and i that's what i'm going to be doing over the course of my break which is also going to be short i just want to be sure that i really take what i learned and take the data from vlogmas and compare it to what I was doing before and see where I can find a plan for the next year. I am disappointed that I wasn't able to complete the 25 days, but I'm really proud of myself. I pushed myself really hard this month and I chose Vlogmas every single day this month. Besides the last two days, I have chosen Vlogmas over everything else. And while I have no regrets, that obviously was hard on just my personal life. And so I'm happy that Vlogmas is coming to an end because I'm ready to find some sort of balance again. Um, but I will say, even the two days that I missed, while I was happy that I wasn't filming, I did kind of miss it. So I'm happy that I still have that like excitement and that I'm not so burnt out that I don't even wanna look at a camera. Like I was excited to film today and I was excited to take you guys with me and like do the whole thing. So I'm really happy that I did do that. And I'm really excited for you guys to see this last video too. But here we are, the last Vlogmas video of 2023. We made it. Who would have thought? <laughs> Not me. So if you celebrate Christmas, I hope you had a wonderful Christmas, a great time with your friends and family and loved ones. I hope you enjoyed Vlogmas from all of the creators that you watched this year. I hope that you enjoyed mine. 
I'm very, very, very excited for 2024 and I just feel like we, we collectively are on the precipice of like doing some really cool shit on the channel. So, so I'm really excited for that. Thank you guys so, so much for supporting me through this and being so kind. Even the haters, thank you for watching me. It puts coins in my pocket, so always love to you. But I appreciate you guys so much, and I hope you have a wonderful day, night, whatever time it is, wherever you are, and I will see you next year. Not next year. <laughs> Bye, guys.